Oh, hello to all of my beautiful subscribers. Welcome back. We in this thing. They keep trying to take a real one out. You can't take a real one out. We ain't about to do it like that. Then. I just want to want y'all to really pay attention, okay? Because at this time, we got a lot of hypocritical ass people. These people sit up here and be having all these different things to pretend as they believe in God, but they be the same ones that's crucifying you behind closed doors. I can't make this up if I wanted to. They don't like the fact that you were a wounded warrior or you overcame that wounded warrior spirit in you, okay? I was just watching a very good reader earlier, okay? That's very motivational, very uplifting, okay? And they was basically saying, if you guys was to write a book basically about what you've been through, some of these people wouldn't even believe it because some of you guys, you're supposed to have been dead already. You're supposed to have been in a crazy home. You were supposed to have committed suicide. You were supposed to do a lot of things to yourself, but with the grace of God, you ain't do none of that. None of it. Now, like I said, so many people try to come up against you because they want you, they want to end you. Like these people is like their own worst enemy. But when it comes to you, they want you to be your own worst, worst enemy. No, these people are their own enemy. Because you wouldn't have to hate somebody so much or be jealous of somebody so much or plot and plan on somebody so much if you wasn't your own worst enemy. They don't like the fact that you deal with your, your demons accordingly, okay? And for some of you, y'all actually fighting these people demons because they're projecting their insecurities onto you. I told you. Like, the devil already lost. Okay, but these flying monkeys and these minions just keep it up. They just keep going. Like, they don't get tired like Kevin Gates or some shit like that. And the seven of us, I'm telling you, your ancestors is whooping these people ass. If they ever thought to come up against somebody that's royalty. Period. You are the boss. All these people that got paid offerings to come up against you, to destroy you, to make you go crazy, to make you seem like you're somebody you're not. Oh, you're crazy. Oh, you need to belong here. You belong here. Like so many people are sending you hexes 222. Two, two. It just don't make no sense. But they're hexing themselves. That's the thing. Like, as I said, all day, people going to be winning stupid ass prizes all day because they think because of Lionsgate, they going to be getting all these accolades. No, you just going to be looking stupid. That's what you're going to be looking like. Because half of your readers ain't making sense. How you go from, you could, all you got to do is pay attention to their readers. How you go from, Talking about so much negativity to now going to positivity. All your reading should be positive. That's how you know these people is working with the devil. <laughs> Look, they going through karma. I'm telling you, some of these people sold they sold and they didn't even know it. And it was all because of money. They wanted what you had. I'm telling you, y'all too royal. These people are competing with you for your bloodline. What's old and due to you? Yeah, because you are very, like, successful. Okay? You can wear the same shit each and every day. It's, it don't matter. It's the spirit that you have within you. It's the heart that's within you. Like, what's up with these people? Like, I'm telling you, these people got a problem. They got real, they got an issue. And the issue is within themselves. It's not even with you. It's within themselves because they look at you and they feel like, they got all these problems made up in their head. That's how you know these people are cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs, okay? And they trying to make it seem like you cuckoo when it's really them. Four of Pentacles. I'm telling you, the Grim Reaper is like, bruh, y'all about to pay up like some series. Some of these people got to pay the piper. And they don't even have the, the advancements to even pay the piper, Okay? Some of these people already have to give offerings to the devil in order to keep up with the um the the some of the stuff that they're reading okay some of these people they get their gifts from the devil like period that's the only way they can keep up with this facade that they got going on a bunch of mind manipulation they keep trying to like be your puppet master they keep trying to think they pulling strings in the background not knowing that your ancestors be leading these people towards you to do these things until these people learn that you are sad Full, full, full. I'm telling you, you so protected, don't make no sense. To these people know, that's what I'm saying. People are so worried about who you are 
with your bloodline, not knowing that you are gutter, governed by Saturn. You have Capricorn energy in you. That's why I said, like, these people are their own worst enemy. They trying to make you be an enemy, but they're their own worst enemies, bro. And it's starting to become sad at this point. It's really starting to become sad. I'll be, I'm telling you, it's backfiring something serious. These people know that it's coming back. They know. They shaking in their boots. You see how they shaking in their boots? It's more than one person. It's like a group of people. It's like each and every day these people be like calling in these people to go against you, to start like a smear campaign. That's what this is. It's a smear campaign going on, okay? And all this is publicly. All this is going viral. Five, five, five. It's like everything that these people keep trying to expose about you, it just showed them who they truly are. Just period. That's why it's just starting to become redundant at this point. But like you said, if these people knew, like I said, sorry, if these people knew better, they'd do better. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This is beyond me. This is just beyond me. All because of your bloodline, who you are. Some of these people are even doing insurance fraud on you. Okay, they trying to take you out so they can get your wealth and your riches and shit. Yeah, hey, spirit, the universe said not going to happen. What's going to happen is that shit going to reverse back onto y'all tenfold. That's why I said any negative energy sent towards me is going back to who sent it and who is a part of it. I'm telling you, now these people is worried. They're more worried than you're worried. Because they know they got to pay it back some way, one or another with their life. or Because they can't take you out, just period. Like, you be too ahead of these people. I don't understand why they just keep thinking shit is sweet. 717, you too ahead of these people. You just too, too, too. It's like, just like that channeling I did. While they trying to backdoor you, they the ones being backdoored. Because you know, when you give up, when you, it's a price to, pr blah, blah, blah. it's a price to pay when the devil gives you an offer. If they can't offer you up to sacrifice you, they going to be the sacrifice. That's why it's best to listen to God and obey God and be obedient. Because that same sacrifice you trying to place on somebody else, it will be you. Period. It's like people can't wake up no more and live a normal, normal average life because you clown ass motherfuckers and these goddamn rituals and shit y'all keep doing, trying to sacrifice people because of their gifts and who they are. Y'all get set up every time. The devil just be setting y'all up. I'm telling you, you and the devil and all y'all that's in this devil energy, y'all under judgment. It's going to be y'all that's going to have to pay the piper. Just period. That's why the devil is like not even like. It's like he wasting his time. I'm telling you. I'm telling you the person that's in charge of the magic is God. Not the devil. Not whoever. Uh, what is it? Join y'all in this group. This clique. This gang. Or whatever affiliation y'all got going on here. God is in charge. You see? You see? I'm going to put it closer so everybody can see that God is the true magician. That's why I said no form, no weapon formed against you, let alone myself or my kids, will and shall not ever prosper, period. Like, when is they going to get that? They keep trying to put you down. They want to take you out of the game. God said, no, it's not going to happen. The Ten of Cups. Like, you still going to get your wishes fulfillment? Now, it's a different story if you was going around bothering people and fucking with people. Then, yeah, you get whatever comes to you. Because it's a lesson you got to learn for going around bullying people, fucking with people. Starting drama with people like this. This is just a bunch of drama. They want you to feed into the negativity. 
So you can lower your vibrations, but you're too, too, you're too high up. I'm hearing that song by Drake. Way up, I feel blessed. Way up, I feel blessed. Way up, I feel blessed. Like they want you to be down on your dingaling or something like that. You know how people say your dingaling is in the dirt and all that. I'm telling you, they praying on your downfall. Now I'm hearing T Grizzly. Now we got the Emperor, the Queen of Wands, the Nine of Cups, the Seven of Cups, and the Five of Pentacles. Some of these people are trying to figure out how you know this stuff. Like, how you know it's them? Like, how you know it was me? How you know? Because you know God revealing these people to you. You ask God to reveal all your enemies, and that's what he's doing. I'm telling you, I just did that. I asked him. I said, God, you the real MVP. Keep revealing all my enemies to me. And that's what he's doing. All you got to do is ask, and you shall receive. You ain't got to fight fire with fire and, 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 and sit up here, pull cars, and start a slander or smear campaign. No, defend yourself first and foremost. You always supposed to defend yourself. Don't let nobody sucker you out your position or out your spot or who you are and who God sees you as to be. 11 11, just period. That goes for anybody. Because the, the one that's really in control here is God, not the devil. That's why the devil loses every time. And for some of you, this is a female, this is a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, fem feminine. Okay? Or whatever sign she is, that's in her masculine energy. She wanted your spot. She got paid to do this. And still trying to figure out why everything isn't working or why everything is still at the Five of Pentacles. This person did everything to cause confusions and illusions and to put you in a lot and it still ain't work. You're still getting what it is that you want. You're still being blessed. Why this person is about to go through some form of like delusion. Like somebody is about to go through some delusion. I'm telling you. Because this person wanted you to be delusional. That's why I said stop wishing shit on people, man. 12-12. Y'all just need to get that shit up. This person wished some form of delusion on you. In one of their readings, 1222, this person wanted you to be delusional so that way you can lose everything. I'm telling you, these people be playing with word. They be doing word hexes. They sit over here and try to prophesize over your life so these things can happen, not knowing that they don't even have that much power to even do that. Just period. Okay. Ain't no demon in hell can come come against God. No demon in hell. Just period. Now, what God will do is make you learn a valuable lesson from these people. from For, for like, even entertaining these people or even giving these people your energy. That's why God is revealing these people to you so you can know who to give your energy to next time you come across Anybody that's prophesizing over your life, 1313, because some of these people are prophesizing ill will over your life to cause you to go through some form of psychosis or delusion to make you lose your mind or seem crazy. When it's really them that they about, that's about to go crazy, everything people wish on you, is, it happens to them. I'm, I'm telling you, that's why I wish people the best. All my enemies, I wish y'all the best. 1333, I don't wish ill on you or none of that. I just wish the best. And that you find a way to build a connection with God. That's it. And that's all. I can't be. Who am I to sit up here and say, oh, you're going to go through this. You're going to go through that. Now, if it's in the reading and I'm being told to say that, then yeah. But nine times out of ten, I'm not going to sit up here and break you down as a person to make you feel less of yourself. Like, who does that? These demons don't like the fact that you are above them. That's what it is. You are above them. And God placed you there. You didn't place yourself there. God did that. That's why I said these people is not who they claim to be. 1414 got all this stuff that that's hanging up or sitting on their table when they do these readings about God. And the whole time, they the ones that's spiritually hexing y'all. They the ones that's causing all this warfare and spiritual warfare and shit like that. So you wonder why you keep going through all these psychic attacks. It's because... It's the people, we're giving out energy to the wrong people, just period. Some of these people are even lucky to even come across your energy. And that's the thing. 1444. That's why I said, like, the devil has his ways and God has his ways too. But 
Everything that God do is very strategic. Everything the devil do is not because the devil likes to put things out on blast, on jump street. They like to be the center of attention. It's like they want to be seen. They want to be noticed. They want to be heard. God, when he step on the scene, he's already noticed. He's already seen. He's already heard. 15, 15. You ain't got to do too much for attention. That's why I said these people is a bunch of clout chasers. And they chasing the wrong clout just for fame, fortune, and attention. And the same thing that they're they chasing after is the same thing that's going they're going to have to give their soul to. That's why I said I'm not pressed for fame. I'm not pressed for none of that, bruh, at all, period. I just want to live a peaceful life, and I just want everybody to get the fuck off my back. Like, that's that's it, and that's all. But I see, I'm going to just have to let God deal with y'all, and he choose what he want to do to y'all, because y'all just won't get off my back. It's like a fucking monk. It's just a bunch of monkeys. That's all it is. Y'all just a bunch of monkeys. Just, oh, oh, ah, 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 all around every fucking way. Just making a whole bunch of noise. You ain't making no sense. All they do is learn how, all they know how to do is gossip and run people's names through the mud. Not then, not then, not a person can sit up here and motivate you to get to where you need to be. But when they look at you and they see you, they like, oh, oh, no, nah, we can't, we can't do that because they see the light within you. It's not hard to miss, bruh. It's not that hard to miss. This, that's why I say it's starting to become pathetic at this point with these people. Look, that's the truth. Everything I'm saying is the truth, bruh. That's why I say I don't got to sit up here and do too much for y'all to believe me and just be making that stuff. I'm telling you, shit is backfiring like no other, bro. Like no other. They want you to stay in this low vibrational energy or just be full of drama. Don't nobody got time for their homes. Don't nobody got time for their homes. We got places to be, stuff to do for generations to come. And all you motherfuckers want to do is just be some ball biters. I don't know. Like, y'all just in the way at this point. I'm telling you, it's a coven of people because they want your fame. They want your stardom. They want your spot. They want your position. But none of these people got star-like qualities. So how you going to want to be something that you're not? Like, make it make sense. Stop trying to fit yourself in somebody else's shoes and you not even able to fit their shoes. Because I'm telling you, if these people would experience half of the shit that you went through or that you experienced throughout your whole life from childhood, these people would never made it. They would have been committed suicide. They would have been that. I'm telling you, everything that these people wishing on you, just imagine if they would have been put through the ringer just the same way you was put through. They wouldn't be able to survive, bro. I'm telling you. This is the survival of the fittest mode right now. God is showing who the real true survivors are. We the ones that had to endure most of this shit. Not y'all, because y'all the ones that's casting it. Like, make it make sense. Y'all goofy as fuck. Like, y'all goofy, bruh. All y'all, y'all just goofy, homes. Y'all goofy. Just goofy. And then because you stay true to yourself and you stand in your power and you not backing down to nobody, it's like they want you to back down to them like, okay, a master. Like, you ain't nobody damn slave. This is not the 1970s, 1960s, or the 1920s, like, or the 70s, whatever. I don't know what the fuck y'all think this is. It's not giving it at all, period. Bunch of low-life-ass people. We got the eight of, Pen eight of swords. I'm telling you, they, they keep trying to trap you or put you in, like, some trap. Some of these people, they really want you to lose your mental. Like, your men like they really want you to go crazy or some shit like that. Like, this is beyond me. Check out Capricorn's reading. I only got five minutes in on Capricorn's reading. It's because they keep stopping my videos. Because they don't want the truth out. And the truth is what the truth is. The truth is in the pudding, bruh. I'm telling you. The same torture that they're trying to place onto you is nothing compared to the torture that God is about to put on them. I'm telling you, you're not powerful than God. At least you know your role. At least you know you ain't above God. At least you know that you don't just take matters into your own hands. 
You pray and you leave it and give it to God. These people don't. They feel like, oh, why I, 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 I can do this and I can do that. And, da, 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 and then the whole time, they not going to be the ones to perform. You can't even perform, bro. That's why you got to do word hexes and word witchery, word witchery and shit like that. For some of you, this is like a voodooist or a hoodooist. This woman right here, she do voodoo on people. And she ain't even got had no reason to do voodoo on you, bruh. Like, this is sad. That's how you know this person is pathetic. Five of Pentacles and the Seven of Cups. This person don't have to have no reason to put voodoo on you. They'll just do it. You throw some cash in this person's face, they want to do all types of shit towards you. Not knowing that they saw they so a long time ago. Because this is not the first ordeal this person was into. This person had multiple attempts. On people trying to get rid of them, kill them, sacrifice them and shit. I'm telling you, this is not the first time this person did this. It's not. This person did this multiple times. Putting voodoo and hexes, like wishing death on people, bruh. This person cast spells. I'm telling you, this is a voodooist. The queen of wands and the nine of cups, that's all they do is sit around and do rituals all day. They do spells on people all day if, if they feel like that they can take from you and, and and take you out the game oh yeah they're going to try to make you have some form of delusion to take yourself out but the blood is on this person's hands no matter that's why i said y'all playing around with spiritual shit and y'all know what y'all playing with when you try to spiritually assassinate or sacrifice somebody it's not a, not two it's either one or two things it's going to happen in the physical and now that blood is on your hands and you got to pay the price for every spell that you done cast and, and thrown upon on somebody. Do y'all know? It's not only blood on your hands spiritually. It's blood on your hands physically, bruh. You got to pay for that. For a life that wasn't even supposed to be taken at this time. That's, I don't understand why y'all keep playing with this shit. Like it's a joke or something. Because when it's time for you to go get judged and you actually go... To see God, bruh, you're going to have to be accounted for everything you done did on somebody. What you thought that you took to the grave and nobody is going to bring back up. Oh, it's coming up. That's why I said. Y'all need to stop fucking with people. <laughs> I'm telling you. These people, it's, it's nothing new to these people because they get away with doing this shit to so many people. But they came up against the wrong person. And it's backfiring. That's why I said it's game over for this coven. For these people, for this group of people, whoever is involved in this shit, it's over for them. Okay? It's over. They thought, look, they were so happy celebrating your demise. Oh, yeah, we're going to make sure he or she go crazy. We're going to make sure he or she lose their mind. So that way, everybody can look at them like it's something wrong with them. I told you they crazy. I told you, I told you, I told you, I told you. And Spirit is like, no, we told you to leave this person the fuck alone. And you chose not to. So now everybody about to see you go crazy. That's why I sung that song in Capricorn's Reader. I'm telling you, I be on point with shit, bruh. I was singing that song, Go Crazy, in Capricorn's Reader. And this, that's what these people wanted you to do. They wanted you to go crazy. They wanted to apply so much pressure onto you. To make you have like some form of psychosis or go delusional. And now this person is dealing with that same delusion they try to put on you. So if you wonder why some of these readers are starting not to make sense when they talk. Or it sounds like they just adding on story to a story. It's because they played with the devil. This is beyond me at this point. And this is a feminine energy. That, that that has their own business, their own career. This person has their own social media platform. Okay? I'm telling you, this person been doing this for a long, and stealing people in her intense, all that shit, sacrificing people just so they can stay in, in, like, in their position. It's not happening. I'm I can't make this up. This is not the first time this woman did this. She did this to multiple people. It's just she got away with it. That's the thing. But you ain't getting away with this one, bucko. 
You ain't getting away with this. I'm telling you, you're the empress. They want your money. They want everything you have. They want your life. They want your light. They want it all. Male or female, it don't matter. Take away a resonate. I'm telling you, they want your life. Because these people feel like you got it easy or you got it made. Not knowing that you had a real life fight to get here. What's wrong with these people? I'm telling you. You damn sure ain't, uh, ain't, ain't, ain't people of God. Ain't no way in hell you is doing this shit. 25-25. Ain't no way. You you belong with the devil. That's where you belong to. The devil. I'm telling you they wanted to harm you. It's like they're, they're trying to send people towards you that's no good for you. To either physically harm you or to spiritually harm you. All over a divine union. Like how many times we going to keep telling these people it's not that serious over a divine union. Y'all got to do this. Go through hell and back. Man, yeah, just to keep you stuck because you actually pour enlightenment into your divine masculines or your divine feminines. All these people can talk about is, is gossip. Oh, what the third party doing? How the th Who cares what the third party doing, bro? It's not about the third party. It's really about getting a connection to God before you even think you're about to have any ordained spouse, idiots. 26, 26, I'm sorry to call you an idiot, but that's what y'all act like, a bunch of idiots. Because you don't know as much as you think you know. That's why I don't sit around and boast and brag like I know everything. If I need to sit down and understand what's going on with what God want me to know, if I was my assignment, that's what I'm going to do. I'm not going to sit up here and just start tampering with motherfuckers. Because I don't have nothing going for myself. As much as the person that you're watching right now. Like, stop it. Y'all starting to throw me off, yeah? With this dumb shit y'all got going on. Y'all just a bunch of clowns. I'm telling you. It's like they want you to give up on love, give up on faith, give up on hope. They want you to just feel like the devil won. No, the devil lost. Because whoever this voodoo is down here, this woman... She lost. The family pinnacle, she knows she lost. Now she got to pay up. Her life, her kids' life, somebody, somebody got to go, bro. And it ain't me. Mock my words, it ain't me. I'm telling you. <laughs> y'all keep making a mockery out of God. I'm telling you. He's going to make an example out of all you people. All y'all that's in this low vibrational energy because y'all under judgment. Just period. These people are trying to do, like, it's to the point where these people are trying to do magic on your family, man. Like, your kids. See, when you put people, kids in this shit, now it's a problem. Especially if somebody not even putting your kids in the shit. Like, who does that, bro? Y'all the ones that got a mental problem. And God about to show y'all where the mental problem at. Mm-mm-mm-mm. That's how I can feel these people's energy because they're all in my energy. That's why right now it feel like I'm about to go crazy. No, it's these people. That's why y'all need to return to sender. Return all that energy back to these people. Ask your spirit guides. Ask God. Ask, ask your ancestors to cut the cords and remove these people from your energy. Call your energy back. I reclaim my energy from all unknown people, places, and things. Because they trying to make you go crazy. It's these people that's going crazy. That's why at times when you you under so much psychic attack, it's because these people is all in your energy. Trying to make you have some form of psychosis when it's day ass that's about to have a psychosis. Mm -hmm. <laughs> some of these people are at a distance from you overseas, different countries, state, regions of the world. Like these people just need to sit their ass down. Yeah. And some of them do readings on you. They are reading your energy. They're tapped into your energy and now they're getting their ass whooped. I'm telling you, these people at a distance, everybody want to read and know who you are. Because you a rare breed, like literally. Like everybody want to know who are you, where you come from, where you originated from, because you are a true original. 
And these people are just a bunch of wannabes. Like real shit. They want to be something that they're not. Shit. It, like, I'm telling you. And it's crazy. That's why you're going to stay in this position. Because you don't even want to be in this role. That's the thing. That's why they're not going to get what they're looking for or asking for because they are doing too fucking much just to keep a position that's not even that wasn't even given to you in the first place, huh? Like sit your ass down somewhere. <laughs> I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm telling you, the universe don't play about you. Neither do your ancestors, neither do God, or neither do your spirit guides. They don't play about you, mo. Yeah, these people, and I wish I never did it, ooh, yeah. And I wish I never read it, and I wish I never tapped in his or her energy, cause I'm about to really go insane. And now I can't say it, na 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 la 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 la. Hey, why the fuck I do that to that person? I don't know why I did it, baby. Yeah, I'm telling you, they about to be singing like Mariah. Look, they crying now. Don't cry. Don't cry. Don't go. <laughs> ah! The devil don't like being mocked. Yeah, God don't like being mocked neither. Fuck niggas. Fuck wrong with you. <laughs> Play pussy, get fucked. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. And it's all because you authentic, bro. Right? It's because you are truly you. It makes these people booty hole itch. Like, literally, it makes they butthole itch. That you are, like, so protected. Universally. I'm telling you. They don't even know who you are. That's the thing. They thought they did. Because whoever gave them this false information, whoever gave them this information to do this, whoa, excuse me, to you, misled them. They, like they say, it's always the blind leading the blind, right? They try to keep you blind. They thought it was you that was blind. Uh, you don't know what's going on. <laughs> like a bunch of fucking, um, bunch of, like just a bunch of, <laughs> everybody talking and shit. Everything going around social media about you. And you just sitting right here minding your business, bro. You're just minding your business, enjoying the sun. Some of you guys could be at the beach. You're letting your hair down. You're sipping your mojitas or your margaritas or whatever you're doing. You're just minding your business. Just chilling with God. And here come these demons. Sniffing your ass and shit. Because they booty hole itch. We got the high priestess, I'm telling you. They doing magic on your person. So if your person is under psychic attack, it's because of these karmic tarot readers. Because as soon as your person watch you, all spells break. Because you are the tower. Y'all bring in the tower, Divine Feminist. Y'all got to know who y'all are. The more you stand in your truth and you stand in your power and call your power back, you bring in towers. And the more you keep bringing in towers, the more you're going to be closer and closer to union. So that's why these people are scrambling at the last minute using their last little bit of change they got to do magic on you. And some of these people, they just so slow. It's like the devil could say, I will give you a hundred and something subscribers just so you just, just gossip on this person. Just smear campaign, just like do all that. That's how most of these readers are getting all these followers. Because they're on a witch hunt for the real witches because they're not real witches. They're not natural. They're not authentic. Okay. It wasn't passed down to them in their bloodline because they had to steal and take all their life. While all your life you had to fight. 
That all their life, all they did was still take and set people up. Whether it's death spells or actually killing people. Like, you get what I'm saying? That's why I say, like, these people got more blood in their hands than a little bit. I advise them to sit their ass down. I'm telling you, they're trying to put an ending to your masculine. Because if they can't take you out, they, they go to who they can take out, which is the masculine. Because they feel as though the more this masculine don't be aware of his surroundings, his or her surroundings, or just be consciously aware, that's how they can get to this masculine. So make sure y'all is praying over your masculine, okay? Making sure you're asking God to remove the veil from your masculine eyes. Make sure you're asking God to break any form of chains off of your masculine mentally, physically, emotionally, spiritually, so he can get the clarity and truth that he need. Okay, they don't like the fact you pray for your masculine. You're supposed to. Like, you're supposed to. If this person is for you, you will pray for them. So, yeah, for whoever want to know, yes, I do pray for my master. Yes, I do. The fuck? Just because y'all evil, mean, and wicked and shit like that, that, why would I pray against him, bruh, when he's a part of me? Do that make sense? So, just imagine, by me going through psychic attacks, he going through it. By me not praying, he's not going to feel it. Even if I give a petition to God and I pray each and every day, I know God is foreseeing over my masculine as well because he's my ordained spouse. Like y'all so pressed to take something from somebody that ain't even rightfully yours. Y'all need to just sit y'all ass down. Just sit down. Because God about to sit y'all all the way the fuck down. And y'all know it's coming. It's just a matter of time. It's just a matter of time, bruh. That's why I say I wouldn't even wish death on my worst enemies, right? Because I don't have that in me to do that. Like, what? Y'all goofy. Y'all goofy as shit. Like, for real. <laughs> Y'all goofy. And all this is over your, your fame, bruh. Because you are a true star. Some of you guys, you're really supposed to be a star. A celebrity. Some of you already is a celebrity because you're being noticed all over the 